I'm Nikki and I got this cool, well, cool looking slush puppy set, which is a bit of a throwback to the old childhood. So it's slushy making cup and syrup. So I'm going to have a go at this. So there was two flavours. I got the blue raspberry and there was red cherry. And it says make the perfect slushy in no time with this slush puppy making cup and syrup set. Here it is inside. So I've got straw, mixing straw. Oh, there's instructions in there as well. Like, I got this cool cup, mix up to one litre slush, blue raspberry. Step one place the inner canister cup into the freezer so that would be this bit oh yes that's gonna freeze until it's completely frozen it must be completely solid it may take up to 24 hours it's essential to chill your chosen slushy syrup in the fridge to speed up the making process so i am going to go and pop this in the wait that goes in the freezer and this goes in the fridge i think Cause that yeah oh so i will do the rest of the video tomorrow so it's the next day and i have left this in the freezer overnight and the inner cup is now in there frozen and <laughs> um, so i put approximately five parts water to one part slushy i'm gonna pop the lid on i have to leave that for 10 minutes then i have to stir with the mixer and then I have to leave it for another 10 minutes so I should be back right so it's 10 minutes later and you can see there is ice scraped off the side so I just have to leave it another 10 minutes just thought I would show you that so hopefully this works so here's how it looks now nice and slushy just a pity there isn't a hole in the lid for put the straw through but I'm gonna go over to the couch and try this now. Cheers! It's lovely. I love it. I'm just back from a walk so I was looking forward to this. It is lovely and I hope I can get that syrup again. I might get one for my nephew as well on his birthday so uh mm. You can see now it's gone really slushy inside. Straw is actually so cool because it's a spoon as well. So when you get to the slushy bits, you can eat it easily. And I forgot to say, I have this shirt is new as well. I got it reduced and it actually has puppies on it. So <laughs> suits the video. So now I am going to try and make these DIY candy kit. got in the Japan crate. The chocolate one has the instruction, instructions in English on the little leaflet thing. This one doesn't because this came with the free lucky bag but I looked it up online and uh, I wrote out my little instructions so I'm going to do this one first. So I am going to change the camera so you can see. This uh, camera stand thingy doesn't want to work. Well, it's probably me that's not working rather than thing, but um, sorry about this. So I've got a little um, what I have, and it's said to wash the tray, so I'm just gonna. It says wash the tray. Done. Put the different coloured chocolate pearls into different bowls. Okay, so I have egg cups instead of bowls just because they're tiny. I've got Harry Potter, the sheep and Harry Potter's cauldron. Place your favourite design sheet under the tray. Right. Following the design, use the tweezers to arrange the chocolate pearls on the tray. And then refrigerate for 10 minutes. This is going to take a long time. Probably won't fill them all as a seat. <laughs> I failed already. Alright, so we've got yellow. Yellow. 
This is gonna take forever. Yellow, yellow, mellow, yellow, mellow, blue. Hmm? Well, they match my nails, except I don't have yellow. I'm gonna switch the camera off and then skip to when I have this all done. It actually wasn't too bad once I got used to it, but that doesn't mean I ever want to do this again. I have to put the chocolate in a mug and heat in the microwave for one minute and then stir until it's smooth. So I'm going to do that. So I've got my no, mug, but while it was melting, I was thinking somehow I can't imagine. L or Mello having the patience to do this like they would have patience for general tasks but not when there's sweets or chocolate to be eaten it's like gimme now pour the melted chocolate over the oh I forgot to put these in the refrigerator for 10 minutes I'm gonna go do that so I might as well start this so it says Contains grapes and pineapple powder mix, which is good because they are two of my favourite foods. Add water and start mixing. Then combine jellies and watch the colour change with surprising taste. I shouldn't be mixing powder on here. Oh my god. So I got pineapple grape. Oh, spilled it. It didn't say anything about putting this in the fridge. Right, so that's oh, well, it is gone, my jelly. It is like um gone jelly like already I wonder what the surprising taste is so I'm gonna leave them for a while I think I should put them in the fridge even though it didn't say to but I still have this from my Japan crate as well which I just need to warm up might as well do that now so I put a chocolate drink there and my Yuri and ice cup pour the chocolate over the pearl not me being surprised the cup was hot when I took it out of the microwave. <laughs> I think I'll just eat the rest of the chocolate. <laughs> These have to go in. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to stick the spoon in. Spoon. Ella. I'm gonna go put them in the fridge for an hour and I'll be back then to taste everything. So here's my chocolate and there's the other side and here's my jelly. I really should have put more water in to get more out of it but so this is the pineapple. Grape. I'm guessing this one's gonna be strawberry because it's pink and I love strawberries. I know. I don't know what it is. Ooh, well, that's how it looks. It's got the <laughs> spoon. I'll eat it like over the tray though. I mean, I don't think I'd bother going through making them again, but I know this video is a bit different, but it was a lot of fun on my end. Tomorrow I should be here trying to make ice cream. And I also plan to try and make Hagrid's cookies and his rock cakes that came at the Accio box. Thanks if you watched and I'll be back soon. Bye.